Good morning, my kings and queens. Welcome back to the Kendra and Keanu Daily Show. I'm Kendra. And I'm Keanu. And if you like any of our videos, please hit the subscribe, like, and bell button so you don't miss any of them. Today is Tuesday, April 27, 2021. And the, the, the weather in Pittsburgh is going to be sunshine and clouds mixed. High 82 Fahrenheit. At night, a few clouds low, low 61 Fahrenheit. The sun will rise at 6.23 a.m. and will set at, 11, at 8.11 p.m. Today in history. In 1865, steamboat SS Sultana exploded in the Mississippi River killing up to 1,800 of the 2,427 passengers in the greatest maritime disaster in United States history. Most were paroled in, in U Union POWs on their way home. In 1810, Beethoven composes his famous piano piece for Lewis. Um, the birthdays for today, um, <laughs> Samuel Morse, inventor of Morse code, was born in this day, was born this day in 1791. Lizzo Lizzo pop star turns 32 years old today. Ulysses S. Granted, 18th president of the United States, was born in this was born this day in 1822. Um, please go to our Facebook page and comment your birthday date so you can get a shout out. Happy birthday to any of you watching this video celebrating a birthday today. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. <laughs> Happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> today is Morse code day. The letters SOS, here's some facts of Morse code day. The letters SOS became the standard distress single from around 1908 at the International Conference <laughs> on Morse Code. The, international, the internationally recognized distress signal SOS <laughs> does not stand for any words. The letters were chosen because they are to transmit in Morse code S is three dots and O is three dashes and they are easy to remember and send. It is an interest, interesting fact to note that Morse code is still widely used today. It is mainly radio hams who use the Morse or CW as it is often called. Also, some Morse telegraph enthusiasts also use it. <laughs> Kendra, would you like to hear how Kendra and Kenny's daily show sounds in Morse code? In Morse code? Yes, I, that would be very interesting. <laughs> well, that was very interesting and long. Yeah, it sounded pretty weird. It did. Um, our challenge is to draw a walrus, and you might be asking, why a walrus? Well, we're drawing a walrus because in Spanish, um, Morse 
is Morsa, and Morsa is walrus in Spanish. So we're gonna draw a walrus because Morsa rhymes, and it's almost like Morse. It's Morse code. So, so we're, gonna we're going draw. to draw a walrus in one minute. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna get a timer, our a paper, and in our or drawing utensil. Yes. All right, so ready? we're gonna start the timer in three, two, two one, one, go. go. Okay. So I suddenly oh, forgot what I was drawing. Oh, darn it! I made this already ugly. Okay. It's gonna kind of look like a seal, but then I'm gonna make it a walrus <laughs> somehow. <laughs> oh no! I ruined it. How'd you ruin it? The teeth. Oh, you didn't put the teeth? No, I did, but now they look like bunny teeth. <laughs> you gotta put long teeth. Is that how walrus, what, what, wal, wal, walruses have? You have teeth. <laughs> oh my gosh, what did I do? Okay. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Okay. <laughs> we have 10 seconds left. <laughs> okay. Here. What is the other pillow in mine? This one is mine. There is my walrus. That's a ball. It's playing with a ball. That has it's nothing to do with the picture. This, this is, is my walrus. Yours is cuter than mine. This is my walrus, and I love it. I don't think it looks like a walrus. Oh, well, I don't care. I love it. It's adorable. <laughs> okay, next. Um. Okay. Our shoutouts for today is to Autumn Regan, my friend from school. Um. Kenny, would you like to do the first joke? Yes, please. Tap dancing as an art form never really spoke to me until I learned Morse code. <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> oh, I get it. Kendra, what's your joke for today? A series of dots and dashes is Morse code. A series of sobs and tears is remorse code. <laughs> <laughs> remorse. That's like depression, right? Like obsession. Like upset. You're upset. Okay. What is our tongue twister for today, Kendra? Our tongue twister for today is a cinnamon. Uh, I can't even say the first word. A synonym for cinnamon is a cinnamon. Cinnamon. <laughs> Why are you making it so hard? A cinnamon is. <laughs> you said it wrong. A, a cinnamon. <laughs> a cinnamon. <laughs> That's no, all the cin Isn't cinnamon? It's cinnamon. A cin a cinnamon. A cinnamon. A cinnamon. A cinnamon. A cinnamon. For cinnamon is a cinnamon, cinnamon. <laughs> a cinnamon for cinnamon is a cinnamon, cinnamon. A cinnamon for cinnamon is a cinnamon, cinnamon. <laughs> a cinnamon for cinnamon is cinnamon, cinnamon. A cinnamon, <laughs> no, a cin. <laughs> A cin a a cinnamon a cinnamon a cinnamon it for cinnamon is a cinnamon cinnamon. Okay. Remember, do what you love and do it often. Goodbye, my kings and queens. Please come back next time, and don't forget to share this video with your friends and family. Bye.